Hi there! This video is here to help you multiply fractions by fractions. Let's have a quick reminder all about fractions. A fraction is a number that represents part of a whole. A fraction has a numerator and a denominator. The denominator tells us how many equal parts the whole is divided into and the numerator tells us how many of those parts we have. So in this rectangle showing three quarters, the whole rectangle is divided into four equal parts and three of them are shaded blue. We can use the area of a rectangle to help us to understand how to multiply fractions. Remember, when we are calculating the area of a rectangle, we multiply the length by the width. To multiply three quarters by two thirds, we can represent it with an area model. To represent three quarters, we need to split the rectangle into four equal pieces and shade three of those pieces. To represent two thirds, we need to split the rectangle into three equal pieces and shade two of the pieces. When we combine these to represent two thirds multiplied by three quarters, the area shaded green is the area representing both the length, three quarters, and the width, two thirds. In our model, there are 12 equal sections in total, and six of the sections are shaded green, so six twelfths of the model is green. The sections shaded green represent the answer to our question, as this is where the two diagrams overlap. This means that three quarters of the rectangle multiplied by two thirds of the rectangle equals six twelfths of the rectangle. Three quarters multiplied by two thirds equals six twelfths. What do you notice about the numerators in the multiplicand, the multiplier and the product? What do you notice about the denominators in the multiplicand, the multiplier and the product? Looking at the numerators, 3 multiplied by 2 equals 6. Looking at the denominators, 4 multiplied by 3 equals 12. So when we multiply fractions, we can multiply the numerators to find the numerator and then multiply the denominators to find the denominator. Finally, we need to check if we can simplify our answer. 6 twelfths can be simplified to 1 half. So 3 quarters multiplied by 2 thirds equals 1 half half. If you need a reminder about simplifying fractions, you can watch the simplifying fractions video to help. Now it's your turn. Remember the steps. Multiply the numerators, multiply the denominators, and then check if you can simplify the answer. Pause the video while you answer the calculations and come back when you're ready to check. Let's check your answers. How did you get on? If you need a recap of how you should have answered these questions, you can always rewind the video. Now for the final challenge. Can you identify the missing digits in this calculation? Pause now while you solve it. How did you get on? Check your answer and fix any mistakes. Pause again if you need a closer look. I hope this video has helped you to understand how to multiply fractions by fractions. If you still need more maths help, then make sure to check out our other videos on the Twinkle website. Thank you for watching!